Well, how often do we think that there needs to be more good out there in the world? Always. Um, a professor at UNT and his students realized that in order to find the good, sometimes you really do have to help mm. just to create it. Here's today's Giggy Bites. First thing I want to clear up is make As sure professor of clear, political I'm science sure at the University of North Texas, of Dr. James Miernick could spend all day lecturing about world peace. How hard are you going to push for it? But he believes the best way to learn about peace is to work toward it. To really understand a subject, to really understand how it operates, you need some kind of experience. Specifically, earlier this semester, Dr. Miernick was teaching the students in his Peace Studies class about the Republic of Colombia. For decades, Colombia was engaged in civil war, armed conflict, and unrest. And although a peace deal was signed a few years back, extortion, gangs, and cartels still put millions of Colombians at risk. These communities are still trying to build their own peace after decades of war. So instead of just talking about peace, Dr. Miernick asked his students to get involved. It doesn't take a whole lot to help. He devised a project to collect school supplies and then send those supplies to children in Colombia. Does all that make sense? Do you kind Which of understand they realized was far more challenging than expected. We learn a lot about the insurmountable nature of poverty. But they also saw what it's like to live what you've learned. At the end of the project, Dr. Miernick traveled to Colombia to help pass out the supplies. For developing expertise in peacekeeping like His students understand a few boxes of school supplies won't bring world peace, but it is a start and a chance to bring people together. JFK actually has a quote that's, uh, everybody can make a difference and everyone should try. If everyone took the time out of their day to do a small thing for someone else, Yes, we may not achieve full world peace, but we'll get closer. Dr. Miernick plans to keep doing this each year. What still happens, though, is that because you still have kind of we could spend all day wishing like for world peace. But the best way to learn is to go out and, and make it happen. All right, so take care. We'll see you on Thursday. In Denton, I'm Sean Giggy. All right, so the takeaway there is you don't have to go change the whole world. You just do your own little part, one little thing. Just yeah, I think sometimes thing. it gets overwhelming. Yeah. Start small. Yeah, baby steps.